Warum? With the last Warp on Shop update, Gaijin changed some of the rewards in the shop. One of them were the talismans. We are now able to buy talismans for free with the war bonds. And with this we can boost our research points revenue for our non-premium vehicles. I was a bit skeptical about the war bond talisman, but since I enjoy War Thunder completely free to play, I had to give it a try. So this video might be no news for some of you guys, but I got really lucky with my drop and now I'm able to research my rank 3 and 5 aircrafts for Germany with ease. This is why I wanted to share with you this new opportunity and maybe I'm able to help someone else with the grind. I'm curious if you guys also got some talismans and what your experiences are. Let me know about it in the comments. How does it work? First off, I have to point out why I was skeptical about the talisman in the first place. When you now buy it for free via the Warborn shop, you can only choose the rank and vehicle type of the talisman. So for example, a talisman for an aircraft on rank 4. The nation and the actual vehicle are picked completely random by the game. The only premise is that you have to already own the vehicle that is picked by the game. So as far as I know, Warfunder can't pick a vehicle you haven't started to research yet and assign the talisman to it. So a good drop is completely based on luck or you had planned it far ahead. How to get a talisman with warbonds? To buy a talisman from the warbond shop you need warbonds, some medals and the respective level of the warbond shop. We can obtain those things by just playing the game and leveling the battle pass. With the daily tasks for example you can level the battle pass and therefore get free warbonds. So check if you can do them. In the warbond shop you can buy special task medals for 30 warbonds. To get the medal you have to do the special task. They are a bit more difficult and you may need some time to fulfill them. But no worry the shop lasts for a good amount of days. The hardest part might be to get the respective level of the warbond shop to be able to purchase the talisman you want because this again is connected to the battle pass. At the moment we can get some talismans for ships at rank 1 and 2 and for tanks and planes between rank 1 and 3. This is not that difficult to achieve with only 12 medals and a shop level 4, but in my opinion not that interesting. The range of the ranks is just too big since the drop is completely random. I aimed for the talisman at a shop level 5 and had to gather 20 medals and 2800 war bonds. This talisman drops for a rank 4 aircraft or tank and for rank 3 ships. If you have a lot of spare time you can even go for the rank 5 talisman that needs a total of 40 medals and shop level 6. I can't even tell if you can get this completely free to play because you will need a lot of war bonds. In the end I was lucky and got a talisman for the ME410 B6R3. In a good game I can make around 10,000 research points in realistic battles and can now grind without any trouble. The next battle pass and warbond shop is on its way and I try to get another free talisman for my rank 4 planes. Hopefully it will drop for another nation than Germany. In conclusion, I would not recommend to get a talisman for the 12 medals. The range of the ranks is just too big. If you have just started War Thunder, it might be a good choice though, since you shouldn't have that many vehicles in the beginning. Aim for the talisman for 20 medals and pray to the snail that it will drop on a good vehicle. Of course you can also get the free premium vehicles in the Warborn shop. They just weren't interesting to me this time. I hope I was able to give you some tips and you liked the video. Like, subscribe and leave a comment if you want to and check out my discord server for more information and to connect with other players. Hope to see you in game soon.